Hi people, happy new year. I hope everyone is having a great start to 2022. Hopefully 2022 will be better than 2021. Okay, so today I am cash stuffing $13.97. So I will grab that and we will count it out and stuff. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight fifty, nine, nine fifty, ten, ten fifty. Ten seventy, ten ninety, eleven ten, eleven thirty, eleven fifty, eleven seventy, eleven ninety, twelve ten, twelve thirty, twelve fifty, twelve seventy, twelve ninety, thirteen ten, thirteen thirty. Thirteen, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy. Thirteen, seventy-five, thirteen, eighty, thirteen, eighty-five, thirteen, ninety, and then ninety-one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Thirteen, ninety-seven. Okay. So we are gonna start with our cash envelopes. And the first category is food. I um, have not updated it since last month, but I have zero left in food. So we are going to stuff $340, which is going to be three hundred and two twenties. Can you see that? Okay. I will update these later, but that's where we are now, um, starting from scratch. Beauty had $34 in it, and I am giving myself 20 more. So, we should have fifty-four dollars. So twenty, forty, fifty, one, two, three, four. Fashion had seventy dollars in it. And I'm not giving myself anything for this month. So we're leaving it at 70. Yep, 20, 40, 60, 70. Okay, fun had $40 left and I'm giving myself $50, which will just be a 50. So 90 bucks. Household, I emptied that out as well, I had nothing left. Um, so I'm giving myself a hundred dollars this month, and uh, hopefully, that'll be enough. So, miscellaneous, um, I, I've noticed that I have a lot of expenses that don't quite fall into any of these categories, and I find myself taking from other categories um like fun maybe like i'll cut down on how much i go out in order to cover some type of expense so i'm giving myself 250 dollars now because there seem to be so many things that i just don't expect that don't fall into these so anyway um for miscellaneous i'm going to give myself a 100 a 50 three twenties, one, two, 
two, three, three tens, one, two, three, and two fives. So this should be $250. Let's hope. 100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 220, 230, 240, 245, 250. Perfect. Okay, so hopefully I can get it together now. Um, 250 should be enough. I know that I do have some things I have to pay for um, this month that don't fall into the categories, which is another reason why I'm kind of overstuffing it because I know those things are coming up. Um, Starbucks. I have $24 left and I'm not giving myself anything for Starbucks because I have to kind of watch my spending. I spent a lot in these past few months, so I just have to kind of be easy where I can. And since Starbucks is not a necessity, no Starbucks for the month of January, other than whatever I have already on my card. And that's it. Okay, so that is it for my cash envelopes. Next, we are moving on to my sinking funds. So, first category, annuals. Um, I should not have any annuals coming up, but I keep saying that and I keep finding out that I do. I have no money left in annuals, um, but I, I don't think I have anything. But, you know, who knows? I'll keep you posted if I do. Anyway, I'm giving myself $60 for January to start building it back which is going to be 320s. What do y'all think of this red color? You like the red, the black, the white? I'm trying to find my, my background. Anyway, um, car. Okay, so I have $90 in car left, or at least I should. Let's see. Yes. Um, my car insurance is due in March, so I have to start saving for that. I pay semi-annually um, every March and September. So since it's coming up, I have to start putting some money in there. So I'm going to give myself $300 for my car just so I can get ready for the insurance and whatever else. Okay, so that's going to be one two, three, so three, 50, 70, 90. Yep. Three, 90. Okay. Debt. So I am giving myself $120 um, for debt and I have 380. So this should take me to 500. Let's see here, let me grab my 250s and a 20. Okay, do we have $500? Let's see, one, two, Three, three fifty, four, four fifty, four seventy, four ninety, five hundred. Yes, we do. So, you know what that means? That means that I can put this back in the bank and switch it out with this lovely five hundred dollar placeholder. Isn't this cute? I'm so excited. Okay, so we will take that to deposit back in the bank. And we will put this $500 placeholder in here. This is my first one, y'all. I'm so excited. Yay! Okay. Emergency. I am adding $20. And let me see. I had... 130, so this should be 150. 20, 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 50. Beautiful, beautiful. So 
I now have $150 in my emergency fund. Okay, gifts. So gifts, I used up everything. Um, it was, oh, goodness, it was a rough couple of months. I'll just say that. So no major birthdays, no major holidays, nothing coming up in January or February if I'm not. If I'm not mistaken so I'm gonna try to replenish this and see if we can get it together but anyway so we're gonna put $55 in gifts this month which is gonna be 20 40 45 50 and then five ones one two three four five I don't think there's any weddings or anything either, so I should be good. Should give me time to replenish. Okay, goals. Goals, I'm giving myself $20. There I was 150 in here. And I'm giving myself 20. So let's see here. Let me get these all. So this should be. What did I say? I said it was 100. So, okay, 170. So 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 70. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. And travel is my last category, which has $138 in it. I'm going to give myself 62 just to make it an even 200 in travel. And that'll be it. So let's see here. We will add the 50. The 10. And the ones. So we should have $200. 100, 150, 170, 180, 190, 195, 6, 7, 8, 9, 200. Okay, so I will update the ledgers off camera so it will reflect everything. I added a new category called I Want. Um, I There were things like, I don't know, uh, cell phone or... I don't know, some miscellaneous item that I may want that didn't fall into any of these things. So I figured this would be another category for me to save um, for. Maybe just like a small amount here or there for like maybe those big ticket items that I need to just put aside in my sinking funds and just keep working at it. So that's not getting anything this month, but I did add it. Challenge. Okay, so I have finally decided my challenge um i was going to do the hundred envelope challenge but i didn't um i wanted to do something weekly but i didn't want to know the exact amount that i was going to have at the end of the year uh, i don't know that's just my own neuroses i guess i just i wanted to be surprised when i counted out so what i did i put a bunch of numbers in in fact here's my little jar here my little mason jar and initially I was going to do 52 weeks but I knew that I would know what the exact number was at the end of the year and I didn't want to so there are actually 89 pieces of paper in this little jar um, why 89 I don't, I don't know I was just cutting and just cutting 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 squares and when I finished I had 89 so no rhyme or reason to the 89 there's no significance to it that was just where I stopped cutting. So what I'm going to do is pull from this jar every week and that's what I'm going to put aside to save. So I have a separate um, 
little fund for this challenge because it doesn't go into my my sinking fund i didn't budget for it since i don't know how much i'm going to pull so i didn't have um that amount there so i put aside um a few hundred dollars to cover this so the numbers here go from 11 to 100 so most I can pull is 100 the least I can pull is 11 and I figured worst case scenario I would pull like 100 99 98 97 so for the month so I pulled out uh, I think it was like 350 dollars just for these challenges and I will add to it as um, I earn more just so I have enough to cover whatever number I pull. So anywho, enough talking. I just wanted you to understand what I was doing. I, okay. And this will be my first one. Oh, there are these little balls at the bottom. They mean nothing. They just came in the, when I got this, um, from someone else, the balls were there and I just liked how they sounded. So I left them anyway. This is my first week, so let's see what we got. Oh, I have multiple, okay. So first week is 79. Can you see that? Okay, so I will stuff $79. All right, let me put this up. Oops, Ooh, this is gonna be a pain in the butt. Okay. So I had to go pull from my secret stash. So I have 50, 70, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So I will add this to my challenge envelope. Um, and I'll do this every week. I only do these videos um, once a month. So I... Hold on. Siren. Okay. Before I was so rudely interrupted. Okay, so I only do these videos once a month, but I'm going to be drawing from my jar weekly. Um, if you want to actually see that, I will certainly record it, but I, I hadn't planned on making a video just of me pulling tabs. Um, but I can if you want to see it. So you will probably see every four drawings that I do. Um, so we'll all be surprised at the end. Uh, I'm not going to count it. I will just stuff when I pull. I'm just pulling stuff. And if it starts to get too thick, maybe I will condense it or something. But I'm, I'm not going to count it because I want to be surprised. Anyway, so that is it for my January budget. Um, this is a new year. So we're going to try and just do this together. We're going to get it together. 2022. This is it, y'all. So... Best of luck to everyone and their goals and their endeavors, and I will see you soon.